Last fall, we had come in and used three different types of corn heads with different stalk rolls. Where I'm standing here, we had on a confetti stalk roll. Right beside me, we had a John Deere intermeshing stalk roll. Then further to the south, we had the 360 chain roll. We realized that each stalk or each plant that we raise here is worth seven bushel per thousandth of an acre to it. So as we've been in here, and you can see the flags in the background, we've been in here doing the counts. In a hundred foot of segment of row, we're seeing as more, four and a half more plants to chain roll than we do the confetti roll. So I'm gonna dig here for you and we're gonna show you when the small pieces of stalks from last fall's corn harvest are in the row with the seed and create seedling blight and we spin those plants out underground. So we'll come in here and we'll just do a little discovery work and we'll say what's taking place here. In this case, you can see we have a lot of residue. And so this is an environment that's gonna be really tough for this corn plant to handle. And we see this kind of residue, lots and lots of, it's just basically wads and wads of small residue. Almost look like the silage chopper come through here. And this is exactly what the confetti heads do. They leave this kind of a residue where the row cleaner was struggling to take it out. In this case, you can see here, this seed is trapped and he's trapped right on. And you can already see the mold and the fungi that's on the bacteria that's growing on these pieces of residue that's in here. And this seed just couldn't handle that kind of a growing environment. You can see the roots are entwined right in the residue. So in this case, you can see where my knife is here. You can pick it up. And this guy just couldn't make the surface. Once again, we only have to have about one of these per thousandth of an acre and we have a seven bushel loss. You'll see two different colors of flags, white where there's no plant emerged at all. In other words, that seed, due to the fact of being next to confetti or the fact of cold germ, didn't come up. The yellow is a late emerger and he's at least two collars behind and won't have an ear at all. So as I walk towards you and this 100 feet, we have 16 mistakes, which translates compared to the 360 chain roll, about 1.7 less plants per thousandth of an acre. So if it's seven bushel per every plant, we're looking at almost 12 to 14 bushel difference at this stage of the game. We're just 30 rows south of where we were at the confetti rolls. And we see quite a difference here where the 360 chain roll ran last fall. In this case, in the 100 foot block, we only have four flags versus 16. And you can see that the residue that I've picked up here where there is about that six to seven inches, it's been pierced and opened up and chained. And so we have tremendous breakdown, but at the same time, the number of mistakes is dramatically less. 